Hey guys, I've got a propagation update for you in this video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. As a proud plant mama, I love sharing videos of all my Batana babies. You know I want to show off how much they've grown. Uh, sometimes I complain about how they're dying, but most of them are starting to have babies of their own. Basically, I'm all about plants, and I'm guessing you're here because you are too. So if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button so you don't miss any of my Botana Baby shenanigans. So let's get started. So remember this little cutie from my houseplant tour video? If you haven't already watched that, please check it out. I've got lots of children to show off in those videos. Anywho, I went down this bunny trail of YouTube propagation videos and came across this lady who successfully propagated a bunch of these using rooting hormone and a heating tray, uh, neither of which I have. So instead, I opted for the um, water method and look it, voila, one week later, there's roots. I was really shocked because it took a really long time for my other cuttings to take root. So I was super shocked at how fast these popped out. And another week later, they grew even more. I don't know if it's premature to um, put these in dirt just yet because the roots look really delicate, so I think I'm going to leave them in there for maybe another week. The weather has been really crappy here in Seattle anyway, so I'm going to wait until we get a nice sunny day and repot some of my other babies. So here I'm going to show you what it looks like. You can tell um, where I made my cuttings. But I want to note that there is evidence of new growth in those um, stems where I've, I've cut uh, or I've taken cuttings from before. So this is the very oldest cutting that I have. Um, I, and that's older than the ones that I just showed you guys. But look, see, it's already making new growth. So this is a really good way to encourage your tall and maybe leggy plants to instead grow wider and have more of a bushy look. Yes, bushy is in vogue in some cases, so um, don't be afraid to do so and experiment on some of your Botana babies. In this other clip, I'm going to show you the oldest cutting that I took. Um, unfortunately, I did not document that, um, but it's looking to be pretty healthy. I'm still looking for evidence that it has taken root in its new dirt environment, um, but that's yet to be seen. So I'm going to keep my eye on this one and be sure to update you guys, but I just wanted to show you um, what I did with it. I mean, it's still alive, so <laughs> hopefully it's, doing, it's still doing good. Um, like I said, I'll be sure to update you on this progress as well as the progress on all my other cuttings. Once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I want to let you know that I so appreciate all the knowledge that you guys drop on me when it comes to my mystery plants. You know, when I'm at the store, I can't help but pick up um, those little two inch nursery pot plants and you guys are so helpful in identifying those for me. I really appreciate it. If plants are your thing and you like watching these kinds of updates, don't forget to subscribe and again, hit the notification button so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Till next time.